An East African species of tick survived in a lab without food for eight years. The story began in 1976 when a scientist received a gift from one of his friends, which contained a bunch of East African ticks. That's right. This happened 46 years ago. He was given six adult females, four adult males, and three nymphs. Fast forward to 2022, 46 years later, the ticks are still alive and, well, ticking. First, the scientist didn't know what to do with the gift. So he decided to keep the ticks in his lab to keep him company while he observed them in stable conditions. His long experiment led him to a fascinating discovery about the species survival and reproduction tricks. In 1984, he ran out of a suitable food source for the ticks. Little did he know, the original group of ticks would survive until the next century, growing up and making a family, with many offspring alive and reproducing today. The ticks survived in the lab habitat without food for eight years. Their lab habitat can be described as a dry environment with virtually no access to water. So, how did they survive? Did they feed on air particles, or did they fast for all these years? This accidental discovery made by the scientist needs an explanation. After 45 years of researching the ticks, the scientist published his findings. Argus brumpti are different from the more common tick species. Female Argus brumpti are 20 millimeters long. These ticks do not cause disease or carry pathogens, but their bites can create long-lasting painful lesions. Argus brumpti have soft, leathery skins and unique eating patterns. They bloat less, eat faster, and eat more frequently. Although they are efficient eating machines, the scientist didn't have any more food to feed them after he ran out of lab rabbits, mice, and rats that he used to give the ticks. But it turns out that the ticks were able to survive with longer breaks in between meals. Really long breaks. Four years after the scientist had stopped feeding them, the last original male tick died. The ticks were still surviving without any food aid. The females continued to live for another four years. So the scientist decided to feed the female ticks when he made another interesting discovery. At least one of the original females reproduced and laid a batch of eggs. Asexual reproduction in ticks is rare, which means that the species can store viable sperm for long durations of time. The batch of eggs contained male and female offspring, which are still alive in 2022. This is not the end of the journey for this special tick family. The scientists decided to send them to South Africa, where they will be studied to further understand how they could survive for so many years, conserve water and energy, and multiply. There are several other species that can survive for extended periods of time without food. Bears, for example, can go without food and water for more than 100 days. Spiders can survive without food for up to four months, while some species of frogs that mainly live in wet habitats can go without food for up to 16 months. Sharks, penguins, snakes, turtles, and scorpions also have this incredible superpower. Aquatic salamanders, known as ulms, can last without food for up to 10 years. They do this by reducing their metabolic rate and activity. Then, they reabsorb their own tissue and use it as a food source, which allows them to survive in environments where food is scarce. Do you know of any other lab experiments that have lasted for years? Share your thoughts in the comment section.